Well, following Ghana's quest to strengthen STEM education and restructure the educational system to equip learners or acquire skills to be fit for purpose, the study in India Expo is bent on complementing the country's efforts. According to founder of Peria Africa Foundation, Salai Manikam, the knowledge and capacities of young people should be developed through proper education. She spoke to Joy Business at the Study in India Expo. Ghana's STEM agenda is to prepare the critical mass of empowered Ghanaians for socioeconomic transformation and become active participants in the fourth industrial revolution. According to Salai Manikam, there's the need for human resource development to provide the coaching needed to strengthen and grow the knowledge, skills and abilities of students to take advantage advantage of the advancement of technology globally. I think Ghana is blessed with a lot of natural resources. I think now the human resource is what has to be developed to ably manage the natural resources and this would, um, this would contribute in a major way towards it. Bringing in the human resource required to manage it and any field in India now whether it is agriculture, engineering, or any basic commerce, you always have an IT component which is part of it. So any student goes for any faculty, comes back with the IT um, upgradation. Co-executive director at the India-Africa Trade Council, Nilash G, says if Ghana invests in its young ones, the country's industrialization strategy will be sustainable and provide more jobs for the youth. Well, what India has learned many years back is to put industries in place, to get uh, technology in place, and I'm sure Ghana is also developing, and our government is putting good initiatives in place. So definitely, it could be a good opportunity for everybody in the future by by setting up industries here, by definitely setting up industries and doing the research and development here gradually. If you have good students coming, learning and coming from there, they can do a lot of R&D here also. In future, Ghana could become a hub in Africa for uh, pharmaceutical products. Not only pharmaceuticals, into industry, into trade, into a lot of other issues. So we are looking forward to Ghana being a superpower in Africa, definitely. The study in India offers a wide range of courses right from modern and cutting edge to niche and traditional. The academic edge gained through the program enables overall development and provides opportunities to foster global connections. That's all for now. Uh, more news on our website, myjoyonline.com for slash business. Sports is coming up next.